The GEF supported the Support Service Foundation, SSF, in the implementation of the Satoyama Initiative entitled Multiple Land Use Practices for Biodiversity Conservation and Fire Prevention through an Integrated Production System. Key problems identified were lumbering out of economic trees, hunting of animals, or cultivation of uplands, cultivation of lands along the river bodies, which has led to streams drying up, reduction in soil fertility, rarity and loss of flora and fauna, erosion, lack of jobs, migration of youth, and unemployment. A community entry was done by the project team where they met with the elders and people of the community to outline the purpose of their project. The project commenced with the training of farmers to run the nursery and community labor, which would be used to do the boundary demarcation and planting. The farmers were divided into groups to discuss the project amongst themselves. Interested people in the community were trained as fire volunteer squads to assist community labor and were used to construct fire bells in specific biodiversity areas and community boundaries as well as create green bells to prevent spread fires. There was an establishment of tree nurseries, close to 200,000 ceilings of timber, woodlots and fruit trees, including oflam, mahogany, acacia, acacia, orange, cocoa and mango in the project area. A workshop was organized for women where they were introduced to the microcredit of which interested participants were supported with 100 Ghana cities each to help them invest in livestock farming and trading. Sixty farmers and landowners supported in sustainable land management. The project introduced the farmers to organic agriculture through training in compost preparation and application. Fifty hectares of degraded land on the slopes were replanted. Establishment of two community tree nursery that produced 200,000 indigenous, exotic and economic tree seedlings annually for redistribution to farmers or replanting. The species were oflam, mahogany, acacia, acacia, orange, cocoa and grafted mango. 30 persons were trained in bushfire management and zero tillage. 1,200 hectares of land on the slope was demarcated and placed under natural regeneration, agroforestry and sustainable forest management systems. 40 women were supported with a microcredit of 100 to 100 cities each to help them invest in livestock farming and trading. <laughs>